you again. I'll just let you pass. The boys in the office may need authorization and triplicate, but good hunting out there.
Clarification. We must be more specific, Master. They capture many organics. Translation. Translation. He says that by his very presence, this grip defiles their home and land. He is without any semblance of usefulness to them. Yep, that would be Griff. Extrapolation. I would assume we are free to take him. It is doubtful they will even waste the effort to kill him. Perhaps we can do it faster. Translation. Translation. We are free to leave. You there. I'm, uh, I'm a high-ranking executive at the Zerka Corporation. Uh, there's a big reward if you take me back to Anchorhead. Riff, don't you recognize me? It's Mission. Mission? Is it really you? I heard Taurus was destroyed. I, I thought you were dead. Oh, joy of joys, my little sister is alive. I have to ask you something, Griff. It's important. I ran into Lena. She, she said it was your idea to leave me on Taurus. It isn't true, is it? Uh, well, uh, there's the truth, and then there's the truth, you know. I, I always meant to go back to Taurus just, just as soon as I had the credits to pay off my debts. But credits have been hard to come by. You mean it's true? It was your idea to leave me there? I'm your sister. How could you abandon me like that? Come on, sis. You didn't need me to look after you anymore. You, you may have been young, but you knew how to take care of yourself. Besides, you're here now. I mean, everything worked out fine. That's it? That's all you have to say to me after all these years, after deserting me on Terrace? Well, that and, uh, could you please get me out of here? You got a tough-looking friend there. Yeah, you can find your way from there, right? Can you manage that? What, is there something else? Uh, well, I, I wanted to thank you. And, um, you look like you're doing well. Financially, I mean. Say, um, could you spare me a few credits to get back on my feet? You're hitting me up for credits. I don't believe this. Lena was right about you, Griff. We should have just left you to the sand people. Don't talk to me anymore. Ever. Hmm. That didn't go well. Sis was always a little too fiery for all good. She'll cool down in time. Uh, she'll be okay. We had our fights before. Too bad, though. I really could have used a helping hand right now. You may have saved my life, but I don't have a single credit to my name. Say you wouldn't be able to spare me some credits uh, just till I get back on my feet, you know? Huh. I uh, guess you've been talking to Lena, too. That's okay. I'll figure out a way to get by without your credits. I always do. Besides, uh, I've already got a job lined up for me. Krita, the manager over at the Zirkus Supply Shop, said I could come work for him if I ever get tired of the mines. Yeah. I think I'll go take him up on his offer. You know... Maybe there's something else you can help me with. I need to talk to a guy first and set up the details, but if you're interested in a job, come see me in Greta shop. Goodbye, Mission. Uh, I'm glad you're not dead. Hmm. Hey there. What can I do for you? Look, I'm happy Griff's alive, but I'm mad at him right now. And I don't know what kind of job he's got for you, but... I don't trust him. It's probably just another scam. So, is there anything else you need? Okay, have it your way.
just the person I was hoping to see. Hmm. Save it, Griff. I'm not talking to you. I want no part of whatever you're involved in. Okay, sis, I see you still, man. Fair enough. I don't think you could help me with this anyway. It's uh, more of a job for your friend here. As you may know, tac glands can be refined to a very potent powder. It's the primary ingredient in Teresian ale. That's what makes it so strong. Of course, now that Taurus is pretty much wiped from the face of the map, Teresian ale has become somewhat scarce in that. Very, very valuable. Luckily, I know the secret recipe. I know this guy. He's with the exchange. Now, if I give him a small sample of Teresian ale, he says he can synthesize it and reproduce it in mass quantities. Problem is, I need one of those tac glands to make the first batch. Now that Taurus is a smoke and ruin, the only place to find tac is on Kashyyyk. If you can get your hands on one of those tac glands, I'll make it worth your while. Rip, are you blind? Can't you see you're talking to a Jedi? We're out here trying to save the galaxy. We can't waste time on this. Please, you have to help me. I, I, I promised this guy from the exchange a sample of Teresian ale. If I don't come through for him, he's going to break my legs. Or worse. Yeah, I knew you'd come through for me. You won't regret this. You'll see. Uh, just, just don't take too long, okay? This guy from the exchange could stop by any day. I kind of told him I already had the stuff, so if he shows up and I'm empty-handed, well, let's just say I really, really hope it doesn't come to that. Hey there, what can I do for you? I'm worried about Griff and his latest plan. I got a bad feeling about it. He doesn't know anything about brewing Theresian ale, and now he's got himself mixed up with the exchange. Sometimes Griff can be so stupid. Part of me just wants to let him get what's coming to him. Why not? He turned his back on me. He abandoned me on Terrace, so maybe I should just leave him high and dry now. Maybe a couple broken kneecaps will do him some good. Maybe that's just the kind of jolt he needs to turn his life around. Only, what if they do something worse? They might kill him. I don't want him to die. He doesn't deserve that. But I just can't keep supporting his crazy schemes. Someone has to teach him a lesson. I guess you're right. I'm not going to change him. Griff is going to keep on being Griff. Maybe if we get these tat plans for him, things will work out. Or maybe he'll finally see the light and turn over a new leaf. I know it's not likely, but it's all I have to hope for.
work out. Or maybe he'll finally see the light and turn over a new leaf. I know it's not likely, but it's all I have to hope for.
again, Candace. It has been quite a long time. Jockey? He... He was a warrior under my command up to the Battle of Alfir. But I thought... You thought I was dead, didn't you? You thought all of us that you had set on that attack had perished. You sent us to die in a foolish attack while you directed your forces elsewhere. You broke from the battle plan and let us die being the first to kill the enemy commander. I... I did what was prudent at the time. If I had not done it, the battle would have... The battle would have been won anyway. I am tired of your excuses, Candorous. I have spent years tracking you down since the clans were banished, and I will not rest until I have had my vengeance. I am not afraid of you, and if you choose, you can die by his side as well. I challenge you, Candorous. I challenge you to fight the fight you fled that day above Alfir in the doomed seas of Tatooine. I will be waiting for you. I have spread the news of the challenge since I learned you had landed on this world. All the surviving Mandalorian clans know of what I do here, and that we shall meet on Tatooine to settle this debt of vengeance once and for all. If you fail to meet me there, you shall be stripped of all honor and forever cast out of our society. It will be you and me alone in the two seas of Tatooine. A final battle that can only end in death. I shall be waiting for you there, Candrus. I've been given a challenge I can't ignore. You've got to go to the Dune Seas of Tatooine so I can find Jaggi and kill him for his insult to me. This is between me and Jaggi. You don't have to get involved. If you're lucky, he might spill something before I spread him in a paste over the dunes. You're back! I knew you'd come through for me! I knew I could count on you! Uh, you do have a tech land for me, right? Come to Papa, you sweet simian organ! It may not look like much, but once I turn this into a bottle of Teresian ale, you'll end up being worth a fortune! Thanks, Mission. You won't regret helping me out with this. Please, Griff, let this be the last time. No more cons, no more scams, no more schemes. That's all I ask. Hey, sis, no need to worry about that. I turned over a new leaf. From now on, I'm going to stay out of trouble and do things right. And once we've cornered the market on Parisian Ale, good things will be heading my way. And I'll make it up to your mission. Just wait, you'll see. You know, once we synthesize this and start brewing Teresian Ale in mass quantities, we're going to be looking for some investors. You give me a couple of hundred credits, and I can get you in on the ground floor. You'll get a return of, oh, at least 20 times your investment. Hey, don't worry. You'll get your credits as soon as we start mass producing that Theresian Ale. I just wanted to know if you were interested in an even bigger payoff. You don't know much about business, do you? When an opportunity like this comes along, you have to jump at it. Come on, what do you say?
It's your loss. I better get started brewing that ale. Meet me back here later, and I'll give you a down payment on what I owe you. Good hunting. Thanks for your help. I don't think we'll try holding this position for much longer. We're not soldiers. Did the company send you? It's about time they drove these animals out. Well, you've got a lot of work ahead of you. Do you know about that enclave in the south? Don't even try to go near it. They've taken all the Zerka weapons that were sub- You'll have to find- Yeah, soon- Ah, the Jawas will salvage it eventually anyway. Then we can buy it back and start over. <laughs> Makes sense to me.
So you managed to come after all. I see you brought friends. You brought some of your own as well. Ha! Indeed I did. I foresaw that you might need help, so I arranged a distraction. I do not need to hear your excuses, Jedi. I know why you brought you. Enough of this talk, Joggy. Let's do what we came here to do. We both know the stakes here, and we both know what we must do. It is only in death that this can end. This is a matter of honor. I cannot stand by this insult. I must do this. In the battle above the world of Althir, he ordered us to attack the enemy flank, promising us support. But when he saw better prospects for his own glory, he abandoned us left us to die surrounded by enemies. If I had not attacked when I did, the battle would not have been won so easily. It would still have been won. You sent your own men to die there, Candorous. I cannot forgive you for what you did to us. You will pay. That's not the way it happened. The Alfieri were fighting hard. I saw a break in their defenses that left their center exposed. I had to take the chance. If I had not done what I did, Many more warriors would have died, and the battle would have taken much longer. I stand by my decision. You coward. You glory hunter. You were given direct orders and were part of a plan. You had a responsibility to us. I... I can regret their loss. But it was necessary. He left us to die when his responsibility was to us. Instead, he went hunting more glory for himself. He cost us ours. But, but I do see your point. But why did you have to leave us there to die while you chased glory somewhere else? I saw a chance and I had to take it. It ended the battle quicker than we would have otherwise, and many of our warriors may have died. Mandalore taught us that opportunism and flexibility in battle were to be admired. You may contradict me, but do you contradict him as well? No, I... I... I see that I have been wrong. I have not been true to the teachings of Mandalore. You were right. I was wrong to question your honor, but I must now cleanse mine with my life. And so it shall be. I, I think this has affected me in ways I, I didn't anticipate. I think I'll need time to sort things out. Thanks for what you did. Whatever your intentions might have been, I just need... Time. Greetings again.
hope you'll fulfill your end of the bargain, and Zerka Corporation is grateful. The Sand People will be less of a threat without their chieftain. I will, of course, continue to give you bounties on regular gappy sticks. Everyone helps. Farewell. Zerka Corporation welcomes your future inquiries. I don't like the sound of this. I know people can change no matter how bad they were, but uh, I'm not holding my breath. None of us is perfect, but I've come to realize that Griff is a little less perfect than most. My brother is what he is, but I've learned to deal with that. I'll never forget that he looked after me when I was just a kid, but I don't feel like I owe him anything anymore. I've made my peace with Griff and what he means to me. If he ever shows up again, I'll deal with him. But I'm not going to dwell on my brother anymore. It's time to move forward. So, is there anything else you need? Okay, have it your way. Hey there, what can I do for you? I've made my peace with Griff and what he means to me. If he ever shows up again, I'll deal with him. But I'm not going to dwell on my brother anymore. 
It's time to move forward. So, is there anything else you need? Okay, have it your way. Yeah, what do you want? This thing with Joggy, I, I don't know. Give me some time and I'll be able to sort this out on my own. Is there something else you want? Working for Davik was like driving a spike through the side of your head. Sure, you got something new in there, but in the end, you've lost something as well. Beating up people who wouldn't or couldn't pay, strong-arming his competitors, killing who he said. It was busy work, nothing decent. I've killed many people. I can't say I'm proud of it, but I have. Criminals, competitors, businessmen, police, women, children. Jedi were a better challenge, but they hardly ever poked around in the Undercity until you came along. But I never wanted to challenge you. Never felt the need. Maybe I knew I couldn't win, just like all those years ago. Yeah, probably. <laughs> you probably would have beaten me again. Maybe you would have. But you're not who you were back then. I can tell. You've changed. And maybe I have to. I remember a time when I could do anything I wanted. Kill, maim, murder. It was all the same to me. But now, now that I am older, I can look back and regret. I look back and regret all the chances I had as a warrior. And then all the chances I've had since then. I, I shouldn't be getting like this. Not when so many other things are happening, but it feels like, like something has changed inside and I don't know what it is. Ah, this is unbecoming a warrior. Let's get on with everything before I start getting sentimental or something. Is there something else you want to know? Your choice. I'm here if you want something done right.
Entrance to the Sikh Embassy has been closed temporarily due to a maintenance failure. The main entrance to the Embassy will reopen when the problem has been fixed. The secondary external entrance is reserved for Sikh personnel only and is not to be used by visitors. Those with legitimate business with this Sikh should return when the repairs have been completed.
civili ai quali prova di human act di lo pessimo civili da canchi canna chi li come chi va a morire chi va a morire your wish.
for its water, mind you. It's the Kalto, healing juice, only place where it occurs in the galaxy. And that's about all I got to say about that. Now, let's get going. Oh, I get it. Let's play with the old man's head, is it? He's half senile. He'll forget I said anything. If you have any other questions, you should probably see Rowan Warren. He's the Republic diplomat. He's by the Republic Enclave near the visitor residences. Have a pleasant stay, Master Shelley. Yeah, I can't talk now. I've got to get this cult to load up before my shift is over. Yeah, what do you want? Your job.
this power can be yours. Starforge. I've never seen anything like it. I'm transmitting these coordinates to Admiral Dodonna. Maybe a quick strike by the Republic can cripple the Sith fleet. Message is away. Now we just wait for the Republic to show up. We should be safe here. We're outside their sensor range. Small vanguard of Sith fighters coming in hard. Someone needs to get on those gun turrets. Take those fighters out before they report our position to the main fleet. Incoming fighters! Disruptor field fried our stabilizers. We're lucky we made it down in one piece. But if I can't find the salvage to make repairs, I won't even be able to get the Evan Hawk airborne again. During our clever descent, I noticed the holes of many crashed ships scattered across the landscape. Perhaps the parts you need can be found in the package. But Cathar's right. This planet's a technological graveyard. I saw dozens of downed ships out there. That disruptor field must have wiped them all out. But where could it be coming from? Even if we get the stabilizers fixed, we have to find and disable the source of that disruptor field before we can take off. Otherwise, we'll just end up crashing again. They must have some kind of protection against it, but the Republic fleet won't. We have to find a way to disable that disruptor field, or the Sith will slaughter them. T3's picking up massive power fluctuations on the ship's sensors. They seem to be coming from some type of large stone structure to the east. It looks like some kind of ancient temple. We haven't forgotten about her, but we can't do her much good stuff down here. We have to help ourselves before we can help her. I only hope we can do it. Bastila has been known as a prison for a long time. If he can turn her to the dark side, she will join him and the Sith will be invincible. I fear Bastila will find the lure of the dark side. 
difficult to resist. She is strong in the force. She is also impulsive, willful, and proud, as you once were, Revan. I am glad to hear you say that. Now that you know your true identity, I was afraid you might slip back over to the dark side. If Bastila feels as you do, there may yet be hope for her. Well, if Bastila's in the Starforge, like you said, Joel, and we can't rescue her until we disable that disruptor field. The sooner we investigate that temple to the east, the better. We can probably find the wreckage of a downed ship along the way. If we're lucky, we can salvage some stabilizers from it to get off this planet. I hope everything works out as smooth as you make it sound, Carl. So do I, Mission. So do I. to say what this planet is. Been lost for thousands of years, if not more. It smells like bad, bad karma, so watch your step. And that's about all I got to say about that. Now, let's get going. Oh, I get it. Yeah, what do you want? I'm not happy with the way my life has turned. I'm not the Mandalore I once was. I don't even think I'm the Merc I was when I joined. I think, I think I need something more than killing and fighting in my life. I need a purpose or something like that. The way the Mandalorians, we fought, it holds no appeal for me to rape and ravage worlds for the thrill of battle. It gets old, very old. Honor in battle, cheating death, comrades in arms, the code of the Mandalorians. I think I'm something different now. Maybe more, maybe less. I don't think there is really any place left in the galaxy for the Mandalorian clans like they were. I don't know if I can go on forever fighting as I have. Even warriors get insightful in their old age. Once my time with you is done, once you have moved on to greater things, I'll find my own way once again. Maybe the Mandalorian clans will be reborn again. Maybe even under the Republic. Or the Sith. The dreaming about the future is stupid. We should get down to our business and finish it. If we survive all this, maybe we can talk about it then. Is there something else you want to know? Your choice. I'm here if you want something done right. Yeah, what do you... Your I cut off like he will. Statement. HK-47 is ready to serve, Master. As you desire. Yes, what's on your mind? I don't really know much about this place. I'm sorry. You got it. Hey there. What can I do for you? How am I supposed to know anything about this planet? It's an uncharted world in an unexplored quadrant. I didn't even know this planet was here. Didn't you come back here when you were the Dark Lord? If you don't remember anything about this place, then I, I guess we're just stumbling in the dark. Sorry I can't be more help, you know? Is there anything else I can do for you? Okay, have it your way.
Wait a minute. Do you understand these creatures? You must have learned their language when you came here in search of the secrets to the Star Forge. Back when you were still a Revan. Thank 
What is it? Yeah, what do you want? Your... What?
didn't work. Didn't work. What? 